Hey, this is Brooke Drum from Printabot.com, and I'm showing off the printer belt. This is the beta version. It's going to look a little bit different. Just trying to uh, finish our design, and our water jet's down today, which really, ah. But we can show you a print of the quick sword I drew. Not very sharp, so no danger. But it's hollow, interestingly, to, to go really fast. So this thing is several feet long, actually. And uh, we thought it'd be hilarious to just show a continual print. So we've got it on the drop cam, and we're taking a time lapse of it. And uh, there it is. Print about printing something really long, longer than the bed. It just peels off as it goes. It's almost at five feet, and it's going to go for another foot about an hour. It's all hollow, so you see some, uh, when you do hollow prints that are really big, they cool oddly. So you see some, if you look down at it, you can see some warbling. But I mean, I could have done infill, but man, that would have used the filament. And it looks like right here, and then another 30 inches. I estimated the belt was about 28 inches. Looks like it's uh, getting caught on the lip. Again, a design flaw of this early beta. Uh, the new one doesn't have such a problem. And we're taping both sides. So it's just uh, shin material, stainless steel. So I'll be able to work that out. So, uh, but it's hilarious. I just have it on this uh, aluminum extrusion. I'm watching it with my drop cam from home because it's kind of late. But it is funny. It's really good. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell how good that surface is. It's pretty neat. So anyway, I'll post results when it's done, but uh, pretty fun. Printer belt is rocking it. Yeah.